You're getting to be a big boy. I'm just a kid who's four. Each day I grow some more. I like exploring. I'm Caillou. So many things to do. Each day is something new. I'll share them with you. I'm Caillou. My world is turning, changing each day. With mommy and daddy, I'm finding my way. Growing up is not so tough. I'm done! You are? Let's see. It's me on the swings with Clementine. I can swing higher. It's beautiful, Caillou. Let's put this up on the fridge for everyone to look at. Put a magnet on your picture to make it stick. Okay. Thanks, Mommy. Here's a magnet. <laughs> it jumped. Mm hmm. Here's another one. Wow, it's magic. Did you know that magnets stick to lots of things? Really? Caillou wanted to see what else magnets could stick to. Rosie, these are magnets. Woo! They stick to things. See, they stick. Ooh! Look, it's Magnet Man. <laughs> The magnet likes my car. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Gilbert, do you want a magnet on you? <coughs> Rosie Magnet! You can have the R because R is for Rosie. Gilbert, don't you want to play magnets with me? Hmm. What are you doing, Daddy? I'm building a birdhouse. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> and what are you doing? Sticking magnets on things, but they don't always stick. <laughs> Yay! Do you know why it sticks to the step stool, but not the workbench? Why? Because my workbench is made of wood, and these steps are metal. Magnets only stick to metal. So the only way to know if it'll stick is to try it and find out. Caillou was learning all about magnets. But he was going to need a lot more magnets to play with. Stuck magnets on the stove, on the toaster, and on the big spoon. Huh. I think we have a magnet fiend on the loose. <laughs> Caillou had lots of fun putting magnets everywhere. They can stick upside down. I wish I could do that. Wow! How come you can do that, Caillou? Because I'm Magnet Man! <laughs> Uh-oh. <gasps> I 
can get it down. I'm Magnet Man! Caillou! Caillou, there you are. I've been finding magnets stuck all over the house. That's what magnets do. They stick to things. Not by themselves, they don't. It's time to put them back on the fridge. Do you think we could find all the letters? So Caillou had to find all the magnets he had stuck around the house and unstick them. Here's A and B. He found most of them. I think we're still missing some. Rosie has R. R for Rosie. <laughs> I'm finding all the magnets now. Would you like to help me finish my birdhouse, Caillou? Yeah! We need to put on this little metal lube to hang it up. Whoops! Uh-oh. Hmm. I see it. Me too, but I don't think I can reach it to pick it up. My magnet could pick it up, if it could reach. That's true. Maybe it would reach if we tied a string to it. <laughs> I didn't know you could go fishing with magnets. Bravo! It looks like we have a magnet expert in the family. Caillou was glad he learned all about magnets. And he was very proud that he could help his daddy. Good night, Caillou. Good night. Aha! Uh -huh. Here's another one. Rosie wants to say good night. Nighty night, Caillou. Good night, Rosie. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I'm Magnet Man! <laughs> <laughs> Unhand me, Magnet Man! <laughs> oh, Caillou! Caillou the Dinosaur Hunter. Today. Yay! Caillou had forgotten about their trip to the museum today. Caillou suddenly realized that he couldn't go to a dinosaur museum without his favorite dinosaur, Rexy. Caillou, hurry up! We're all ready to go! Coming, Mommy! You think we'll see Rexy's family there? Yes, I think we will. Yay! Yay! How come there aren't any more dinosaurs? No one really knows for sure, Caillou. <laughs> Dinosaur gone! <laughs> hey, give him back! <laughs> Finally, they arrived at the museum. Caillou couldn't wait to see the dinosaurs. Come on, Mommy. Let's go in. Caillou. Oops, sorry. Caillou, we have to wait for our turn, just like everyone else. Okay. Aren't you forgetting somebody? Uh, Re 
Rexy! Are you sure you don't want to leave Rexy in the car? That way you won't lose him. No, I'll take good care of him. Don't worry, honey. They can't hurt you. What happened to their skin? How come they're only bones? The bones are all that's left of the dinosaurs, Caillou. When the scientists first found these bones, they had to put them back together, just like a puzzle. And only then did they know what dinosaurs looked like. Really? Mm-hmm. Look! Those are the bones of a Tyrannosaurus rex. A T-Rex. That's the same kind of dinosaur as Rexy. Oh, whoa! He's huge! Ooh! Dinosaur! Like Rexy! That's right, Rosie. He is. I never knew there were so many different kinds of dinosaurs. Wow! Look at that! A flying dinosaur! Yep. It's a pterodactyl. Can you imagine what a real pterodactyl would be like? see Mommy, Daddy, or Rosie anywhere. He decided to stay right where he was. Because that's what Mommy said he should do if he ever got lost. Hi there. Is everything okay? Caillou wasn't supposed to talk to strangers. But he knew it was okay to talk to the people who worked at the museum. I can't find my Mommy and Daddy. Oh. So I'm going to sit right here until they come back. That's a very good idea. I'll just wait here with you, okay? Caillou! Mommy, here I am! I'm glad you stayed where you were. It made it easy for me to find you. I hope you weren't scared. Nope, I was talking to the nice guard. Mommy, find Caillou! Just like the scientists found the dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like a dinosaur. Rawr. Ooh! Elephant! That's a woolly mammoth. He needs a haircut. Is he really an elephant? He's the great-great-great-grandfather of all the elephants. Wow! So, did you have fun? Yeah! And now you know what Rexy's family looked like. <gasps> Rexy! Mommy! I don't have Rexy! I left him somewhere! Okay, don't worry. We'll find him. The first place we'll look is the lost and found. That's where people take the things that they find. So if somebody found Rexy, they might bring him here. At the lost and found, Caillou explained to the lady he was looking for Rexy, but she didn't have him. <sighs> Daddy and Caillou looked everywhere for Rexy. We can always check back again at the Lost and Found. Daddy, look! The guard dug Rexy up with the dinosaur bones! Well, hello again. Did you lose someone this time? Yes, thank you. I'm so glad we found you. Look, Mommy, we found him! That's great! Was he hard to find? Nope, because he stayed right where he was, just like he should. Then Rexy is a very smart dinosaur. He sure is. Let's go to the museum. 
What do you want to do today, Caillou? I want to visit another museum. Okay, let's go. We're going to a museum. I really want to go. We're going to a museum. There's lots I want to know. Paintings and works of art, there's lots to see. Where should we start? Fossils and shiny rocks, famous books. And a weird clock. How do they tell time, Daddy? That looks old, that looks new, that looks like an igloo. See that knight? What a sight! His armor doesn't look too light. Daddy, how did he go to the bathroom? I don't know, Caillou. That mummy is a little scary. Cavemen sure were hairy. Things that fly, things that soar. A moon rock and a meteor from outer space. There's lots to learn and see. Museums are fun, don't you agree? I sure do, Daddy. So visit a museum. You really won't believe. All the things you'll see there, you'll never want to leave. You'll, you'll never, never want, want to leave. leave. Yeah. yeah! Caillou the Astronaut. Caillou liked to play and pretend he was someone else. Like a big furry bear. Papa Bear, is that you? <laughs> it's me, Mama Bear. <laughs> Hello, Mama Bear. Let's go find some berries to eat. Roar! Roar! Here are some yummy berries. Some berries aren't good to eat, but these ones are. I can eat a hundred berries. I can eat a million berries. <laughs> Caillou, look what I've got. The lights really work. And see, there are two astronauts inside. Why aren't there any girl astronauts in there? Maybe the girls are in a different spaceship. Let's pretend we're astronauts, Caillou. We're playing bears, right, Caillou? Caillou really wanted to play astronauts, but he was playing with Clementine first. Do you want to play bears with us? You can be baby bear. No, I want to play spaceships. I'll play with Clementine now, and I'll play spaceships with you later, okay? Okay. I'm going into the cave now. Mama Bear, are you in there? Roar! <laughs> <laughs> After playing bears, Caillou was ready for snack time. He was hungry. Caillou, come sit beside me. No, sit next to me. Caillou didn't know who to sit beside. I know. Caillou can sit beside both of us. Soon it was story time, and once again Caillou sat with his friends, Clementine and Xavier. Now what book should I read today? Do you have any books about outer space? Hmm. Yes, here's one. This big yellow ball is the sun, and these are planets. This planet here is the Earth. That's us! That's right, Xavier. The Earth is the planet we live on. And astronauts in spaceships travel to the moon and to all the other planets. Caillou wished he could travel in a spaceship to see all the planets. Here comes Astronaut Caillou!
Shooting stars! Hi, Caillou. Come sit with us. All right, time to go outside and play. Hey! <laughs> now we can play bears again. I can't, Clementine. I said I'd play spaceships with Xavier. You can play, too. We need another astronaut. But I want to play bears. I don't want to play bears. Well, I don't want to play spaceships. What's the problem here? Clementine and Xavier want to play different things. Why don't you try to think of a game everyone would like to play? Caillou tried to think of a game that had spaceships and bears in it. Miss Martin, are there any bears on other planets? I don't know, Caillou. That's a very good question. Maybe there are bears on a planet far, far away somewhere. We can be astronauts as we fly in our spaceship to the very far away bear planet. Bear planet? Yeah, you can be a bear on the bear planet, and we'll come to visit you. Okay. The bear planet is over here, okay? Okay. Come on, Caillou. Let's get in our spaceship. Explore this new planet, astronaut Caillou. Right. Hmm. I don't think anyone lives here. <laughs> Roar! <laughs> what was that? Scared? I'm Mama Bear. Would you like some berries? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Caillou was glad he could play with his friends Clementine and Xavier at the same time. Do, do. 